back for more Stanley Parable. This time, we're gonna tell that butthole of a narrator that he's wrong. I won't listen to him. Okay, let's go. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Whoa. Stanley whoa, 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 decided whoa, 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 to go whoa. to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. This door used to turn that way. What happened? It's weird. Boop. Boop, boop. Boop. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Scroll! This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Boop. Perhaps he wanted to stop by Boop. the employee lounge first, just Boop. to admire it. Boop. Boop. Why does that guy get his own little nice office with a window? Ah, yes. Truly a room worth admiring. It had really been worth the detour after all, just to spend a few moments here in this immaculate, beautifully constructed room. Stanley I... simply stood here, drinking it all in. I hate this room. Screw it! It's boring. Why is there a cup on the floor? Yes. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Nope. Nope. Uh-uh. Door. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Look, I'm gonna Stanley, jump off. I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. Yes, you are. I realize that investing your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. There's someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. Someone you've forgotten about. I refuse. What? Really? I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? Yes. Are you that convinced that I want something bad to happen to you? Very what? much. I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really do want to help you. No, to you don't. To show you something beautiful. Screw you. Let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. No, you're not. Give me a chance. 2B5. Do before. Now listen carefully, this is important. Stanley walked through the red door. That guy's evil. Nope. Blue door for life. Aha. Perhaps you misunderstood. Stanley walked through the red door. Blue door for life. Blue door. I still don't <sighs> think we're communicating properly. Stanley walked through the red door. Dan it. Dan it. Dun, 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 dun. Blue door for life. All right, fine. Go ahead, Stanley. You want to know so badly what's out there? You want to find out what lies at the end of this road you've chosen? Well, don't let me stop you. I do. I do want to know. That's the whole point of this. You see? There's nothing here. That's what I, I thought. I haven't even finished building this section of the map. Because you were never supposed to be here in the first place. Shut up! Broken rooms, exposed developer textures. Is this what you had wanted? Yes. Was it worth ruining the entire story I had written out specifically for you? Yes. Do you not think I put a lot of time into that? No. Because I did. No, you and didn't. in the end, it was all for nothing. Because this is what you wanted to see. Yes. Help me here, Stanley. Help elucidate these strange and unknowable desires of yours. What would have made this game better? Killing. What did you want to see? Vehicles? Yes. Skill trees? Yes. Work with me. You've given me absolutely nothing so far. Tell you what. Let me take a stab in the dark at a new design, and you can give me some feedback. There we go. A third option. This already feels leaps ahead of where we were before. Go ahead, Stanley. Take it for a spin. Okay, I'm going to stop you there. Wow. Now, tell me about your experience with this new version. Would you say that the game benefited from allowing you more choices? Feel free to be honest. I'm looking for some real critical feedback here. Well, it wasn't amazing, and it wasn't awful. I'm going to give it a two. Oh, well, now this is useful. You didn't like it, but you didn't totally hate it either. Yes. You enjoyed it, perhaps is the correct term. It didn't cause you excruciating pain. Yes. Big steps we've made here today, Stanley. True, 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 true. Here, based on the data from your previous playthrough, I've compiled a new version. 
And to be perfectly candid, I think I've knocked it out of the park with this one. Let's take a look. The Stanley Parable Worldwide Leaderboard. Okay, where am I at? The good old Neil. Skid, Nacho Nacho, Vanilla. That's a lot of people. A dead rat? Are you kidding? I'm behind a dead rat. Hey, me. I'm leaving. I'm going through the third door. Yeah. Now, would you what say that competitive leaderboard helped you feel motivated to keep no. walking through doors? No, Again, it didn't. Honest answers, please. No, that was hey, awful. Oh God, I've got a prototype of a new game I've been working on, and now would be a lovely opportunity to give it some playtesting. You wouldn't mind taking a look at it, would you? Perfect. Let me boot it up. Yeah. In this game, the baby crawls left towards danger. You click the button to move him back to the right, and if he reaches the fire, you fail. It's a very meaningful game, all about the desperation and tedium of endlessly confronting the demands of family life. I think the art world hmm. will really take notice. But of course, the message of the game only becomes clear once you've been playing it for about four hours. What? So why don't you give it four hours of play to make sure it's effective? Be sure to keep notes on your experience. No, baby! No! No, 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 no! Game of the year 2016 right here. At Indiecade, this game went so high, it won all the awards. Let's see how far I can get it without losing. <laughs> the baby's basically in the fire. <laughs> My god. It was already burning. <laughs> what? It completely burnt off. You know, what? I'm just not even gonna push it this time. You heartless bastard! You know Why it. You do it because you hate babies, or purely to spite me. Because if it's the latter, well, I don't know what to do. I'm completely out of ideas. I can't think of a single thing that might improve the experience in the corner. for me. I'm not even going to try. I'm out. I'm out. I'm done. It's over. Thank you for playing. Your input was extremely valuable. Oh, hey, since my game was so awful, why don't we play someone else's game? Just to ease the pain. Let's see. What do we have here? <coughs> yes. This seems like it'll work. Let's give it a shot. Oh, well, Minecraft! Stan, is this any better? At last, the one thing you've always desired. A game I had absolutely nothing to do with. Yes. But is it enough? Tell me that, Stanley. Will it ever be enough? Probably not. Well, I'll say this. I'm done making things for you. From now on, I will only create to fulfill a greater artistic purpose. Watch this, Stanley. I'm going to build a house. Whoa. This will go here. No, here. And then... Wow, he's so creative. Let's see what... You can't even go inside I, of it. Yes, of course. And just to finish it all off... Yes. Where do you get the wood for that? Complete. I made this, Stanley. Look at it. Gaze upon my work of art and feel ashamed at your own inadequacy. Shut up. Ah, but you've only seen it from the outside. You've only gotten half the experience. Please, step inside and make yourself comfortable. Isn't it grand? I love it. Isn't it perfect? Yes. It could only be better if... Wait, that's it. We must rebuild it out of diamond. <laughs> diamond everything. Yes, Dirt yes, to yes. diamond. Come along, Stanley. We have to go mining. <gasps> Best game. Well, they actually have like the music and stuff. This is awesome. Let me out. 
There's no jumping in this game. Only falling. Oh my. It looks like it's going to get a bit dark. Have you brought a light? Hmm. No, I didn't. Did you? Ooh, mushrooms. Let's make some mushroom soup. Oh, no, 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 no. This is far more open-ended than iron. I had in mind. I'm looking for something more narrow and linear. Something that Wee. makes you feel utterly irrelevant. This won't do at all. One out of five. Even the diamonds couldn't save uh -oh. this one. Uh-oh, okay, I'm trapped. New game. Help. <laughs> yes! I don't even know what this game is, but I love it. I love it too. Oh, trapped in a glass box with no way out, listening to me <gasps> talk. Oh, it's inspired. I couldn't have done it any better myself. What is this game even supposed to be? I can't figure it out. I love okay, it. Okay, now I'm curious. Let's go find out what the hell this is. Taking the radio with me. Hmm? Oh. What, there's no portal? I'm not allowed to see Stanley? Okay, fine. I'm taking my radio with me. Oh, it's a puzzle. Critical thinking, Stanley. You're 40. So hard. Hmm. Can't figure this out. Genius. See? It only works when I put it down. This is not fair. Fine. I'll do what you want, game. I'm just gonna take my radio with me. No, actually, you know what? I think that's plenty. I really don't care much to see you stumble through any more of these games. You and kidding? I highly doubt you're any wiser for the experience. Which is why, rather than continue to waste my time, I'm just going to leave you here. You can pretend you've beaten the game if it makes it any richer for you, but as for me, I've had enough. So, why don't you get cozy in this room, and if you have any grand revolutionary ideas for the perfect video game, you can just sit there and let it ball up inside you for all eternity. I don't need your advice. I don't need your ratings. And I certainly don't need the validation of a man whose job is to push buttons. Hey. I think I'll just go about my business making meaningful cultural contributions to the world. Suicide! I didn't want to listen to that guy talk anymore. Beta. Work in progress. Okay. I still got my radio. What do I do now? Where do I go? Can I commit suicide? Yep, committing suicide again. <gasps> no! The radio disintegrated! Curse you game, the only thing I wanted was my radio. This is weird. Wait. Oh, this is like the original Stanley Parable, the one that was a mod for Half-Life 2. That's cool. <gasps> light. I see light. That guy forgot to turn his computer off. What a jerk. This is the lonely light. The only light in this entire building. Oh, <gasps> it's employee number 427. Boop, 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 boop. Okay, there's nothing in here. I want in that room. This isn't fair. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Oh. I wonder what he found. If what he wanted was to be the leading man in his own story, well, perhaps he's gotten it. Down in wherever he is right now. I'm in a scary I place. If he's happy with his choice, and if he's learned the heavy cost that comes with it, he'll understand soon what I was trying to tell him. He needs me, someone who will wrap everything up at the end to make sense out of the chaos and the fear and the confusion. That's who I am. 
That is what I mean to this world. Oh, yes. Yes, I'll be back. There's no other way. Once this ends, after it all comes to a close, then I'll be back. I the end will be here soon. Very soon. I can wait. Forever. We can wait forever. Mm. Was that it? Hey, that was the ending where you did literally nothing what he told you to do. Post in the comments what ending you want me to do next. So, goodbye.